Good morning, everybody. So I am going to head to the grocery store. It's Friday and I am really in the mood for some chili again. I just was like, you know what? It's, there's a little chill in the air. <laughs> Can't have chill without the chili. So I'm gonna go get stuff for that. Just get a couple other grocery items and I'm just gonna go in even though I love doing pickup now. But I will say I did pick up. They like got me the worst apples. Let me show you these apples. Oh, this is, you want something to be pissed about today? I'll give you something to be pissed about. Can you see all of the, every single apple in here? And these are honey crisp, they're not cheap. Ro rotten to the core. Like worms in them. This one's even worse. Check out this one. This is only four days ago. Apples should not ever look like this, ever. Look at this, all of them, all of them are bad. So I need to go to the grocery store and just get a couple things. And then I'm also not gonna be streaming today because I need to work on my Amazon favorites video and just, I wanna do another main channel video, but I'm kind of undecided about what video that is. I have a couple leads, but I don't know which direction. So I just feel like I need to sit down and do it. But before I go, unfortunately I have to clean up a mess on the floor. I need to get out my little green Bissell machine thing. That's what I'll be doing, but this does give me an opportunity to show how the little green machine works for my Amazon video. This is the brown, disgusting liquid. This is all that just came up from that spot. Personally, what I do is I dump this into the toilet. I don't dump it into the sink. Just letting you know if you do get this because this will be, the little green machine will be on sale during Prime Day. And it's always my best seller, always my best seller. Whenever I do Prime Day and I like look at, what did people buy? Without fail, the Bissell. But honestly, you need stuff like Okay, I'm heading out. Grocery store time. Oh. All right, I'm home. I ended up saving $40 using the Kroger smart shopping techniques. Like there was a lot of events going on, like mega events. And it was like buy three, get one free, or like it was stuff like that. So I was like, ooh. So I got a lot of stuff where it's like I overbought this week to save for the future kind of thing. So I bought a lot of extra. I got enough for like two nights of our favorite little, you know, the Kylie bowl, which I have termed it. Nothing really new. I did get some of this. We were gonna do a Halloween party, but then I don't think anybody can come. <laughs> and we just have a busy month, so maybe I'll just do this for Jarvis and I, but fun putty. And then it also, I also had a frosting, I don't know where it is, but I got more of these for the chili. These are our favorite, the buffalo chicken. Oh yeah, I thought there wasn't a lot in there. Um, the buffalo chicken patty. I got a bunch of more chilio mix for today. I also got some for the future too. I just, I never know when stuff's gonna sell out, you know? But anyway, while I put this away, I figured I would tell you about Golden Bachelor. Oh my God. I'm not really a, a typical Bachelor watcher. I have watched many seasons before, but typically I don't care for the show. And I think I realized why. And it's because when I watched The Golden Bachelor, which is the first episode, I was kind of like, ew, these people are acting gross. But the second episode yesterday, I was, I cried the whole episode because it's so sweet. It's sad. He is the nicest, the guy's name is Gary, the nicest man on earth, planet earth. 
the nicest, sweetest, most genuine person. I mean, he cries when he sends people home. He's just, it's not even that they don't make them like that anymore. It's that they've never made somebody like that ever. It's so rare to even have a, someone that's that nice. So he just makes all the other bachelor, bachelorettes look so bad because they're just, by comparison, they cannot live up to the standards that Gary has set. So I worry about the Bachelor franchise. I honestly do after Gary because they have a lot to live up to and they're not gonna be able to clear that bar. I love him so much and it just makes me sad. Like they, a lot of them are widowed and I just, I cry like he's so, like he cries with them and they share their stories and they're like, ugh. Makes me sick. Anyway, I love The Golden Bachelor. I think everybody should be watching it. I think every man, woman, child should be watching The Golden Bachelor. That's how I feel because just to watch Gary interact and like see how nice he is and how he listens. He's so intent, he's so li he's listening to every person. He's genuine. Anyway, but Love is Blind, I'm so excited. Speaking of, total contrast, but Love is Blind is on tonight. So I'm really excited about that because the new episodes come out and it's just the craziest season of all time. You guys, if you're not watching Love is Blind, you gotta watch it. It's so good. There is specifically the character not character, but he's a person, obviously. But Uche, in my opinion, is one of, besides Gary from Golden Bachelor, is one of the greatest casts in reality TV show history. Just with all the drama, but the way he's, he's having conversations. I say this and I know it's gonna sound cringe, but it's movie magic when, you, when he is on the screen. Because when he is having conversations with people, it is literally 10 minutes of uncut gold footage where people are having a conversation that is so interesting. It is so like getting down to the brass tacks. I don't know how to explain it. When he's talking to anybody, especially with the situation that's unfurled in front of our eyes with, you know, a love, a certain love triangle and drama and stuff like that. It's just so interesting to watch him interact with people and just have conversations and it's so dynamic. I'm telling you, I'm enthralled. I'm just encaptured. The whole thing, I'm just, I'm taken in, but. Okay, anyway, I gotta put the rest of this away. No more talking about reality TV until I put this away. Okay, Boo and I are here. He's chilling out. I've got my Amazon packages. So I've got a couple that I want to open. I'll just open them today. I hope this is what I think it is. It is. Oh my god. I ordered a fake engagement ring. Oh my god, this is a perfect fit. Holy sh Holy crap! Oh my god. Oh my God. <laughs> Let's take my breath away a little bit. This is humongous. This is three carats. It was 20 bucks. Oh my God, Jarvis is in trouble. I'm gonna need a real one. No, I'm joking, I, this is fine for me. But honestly, I might have, I probably could have gone down one size. But I, got, I just realized that my, I'm just getting so skinny. My fingers are getting skinny. Cause I used to be a size seven. I thought, so I thought, but now this is size six and I feel like it's kind of, it's comfortable but it's kind of falling off, like moving around a little bit, but holy crud. This thing is kind of gorgeous. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. New Taylor Swift merch, new Taylor Swift merch, new Taylor Swift merch. Oh, they just dropped the whole thing. Okay, hold on, BRB. The new collection, it's not that great. I did order, because I wanted to be more selective, only got a t-shirt, this kind of gray t-shirt. That's all I got. Oh, brother. That's gorgeous. Okay, so excited about that, happy about that, thrilled about that, gorgeous, gorgeous, cute. Totally recommend to everybody, hope it doesn't tarnish, but if it does, it was 20 bucks, so. Okay, this is more of our protein. We're still doing the protein every week. 
I have it on auto ship at the moment, so yay. Okay, and then we got something else in this package right here. Sure. Oh, I also got a simple modern. Oh, this was worth it. It was worth it every time. Every time it's worth. Ah, oh, so cute. I just <gasps> rip off. Okay, this I believe is my wedding ring. So I also buy my wedding rings off of Amazon. I have been for the last several years. So I just buy a tungsten ring. I think this one is $16.99. And it never has steered me wrong in any way. Um, it's a little bit different of a color than the one that I'm wearing. So I don't know how great that looks, but yeah, I just, I wear this. It's this one right here. It's just a basic tungsten ring but I needed to get a smaller size because it was flying off my hand but oh yeah that's nice okay so anyway I kind of wish that they were the same color gold but oh well and I kind of wish I ordered one that's a little bit smaller but for both rings I feel like 5.5 would have been perfect because I have a lot of room in there if I I'm gonna go work on my videos and finally start working and doing something productive all right, I've got some rice on the stove right now. And honestly, I just sat around for, I was like actively trying to think of a video idea and I couldn't, I just can't make a decision. Like I can't, I feel like I'm just looking for, I feel like I'm trying too hard at this point, but I don't know. So anyway, I didn't really get anywhere and it's kind of frustrating. So I think I'm just gonna get off my phone. I've been on my phone all day today looking for that good moment for a video and it's just, it's not coming right now, so I'm just gonna chill. I'm gonna make this chili. I'm making the rice right now, and we are gonna watch Love is Blind, finally, which I'm so excited, so that's what's up. Wait, did you tell them about that? Who? Did you tell your blog about that? About what? Your ring? Yeah, I told me you got a promotion at work. Oh. <laughs> anyway, we just watched Love is Blind. I won't give any spoilers, but we need more Uche, that's all I could say. Is So it, the season was like really short. That's kind of weird, so whatever. But anyway guys, I shall see you tomorrow. I'm going to edit this video. And then I have a lot of work I have to do tomorrow. So I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.